Brumbies. The news got even better for the Brums during the week. With confirmation, one of the greats, George Smith, is heading back to Canberra on a short-term contract. It is a 12-week stint replacing the injured Ida Vea. And in a Fox Sports rugby exclusive, George Smith spoke with Sean Maloney a short time ago. He has massive news, not only for the Brumbies, but potentially the Wallabies as well. We'll get to that in just a minute. Uh, George Smith, mate, welcome home. Yeah, it's great to be back. Uh, you know, it's uh, been a while since I've been back in Australia, back in Sydney, and, um, you know, it's great to be here. You know, it's great to, uh, to see the family again and, um, yeah, new challenges ahead. I guess the, the question that uh, is on everyone's lips, why? Why come back? Oh, look, it was presented to me, um, you know, uh, a little while ago, and um, a couple of weeks back, and, uh, you know, I obviously had time to think about it. You know, I, I thought it'd be a, a good way for myself to test myself on in, in the, the Super Rugby arena and um, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty excited about the challenge. Uh, you know, I've had two, two good seasons at, at Suntory San Goliath and um, you know, I think this will definitely test me. How much of a step up will it be for you from Japanese top league back into the Super Rugby ranks? Oh look, it's definitely a step up. Um, I've had a, a bit of freedom with the way that I played the game uh, in, in the top league and you know, it'll, it'll be uh, a bit more structured and a bit more physical than I'm used to but uh, no, I'm definitely uh, always up for the challenge and always up for uh, that, that physical battle. The first game you'll be available for is the match against the Waratahs. Can we expect you to see you playing in that game or perhaps on the bench? Oh, look, I'd love to play uh, within that game, but uh, you know, first and foremost, I have to earn my spot within the Brumbies team. And that's by uh, turning up tomorrow uh, in, in Canberra and, and training well and, and meeting the guys and, uh, and obviously introduce myself to, to a number of the players because a number of them I haven't played alongside, but... Uh, and, and we're aware of who they are. You know, this season they've, they've done uh, extremely well as well. You know, they're, they're obviously coached by uh, an experienced coach and, and a person that uh, a lot of people respect, and, um, and also with Laurie Fisher there and, and Stephen Larkham, uh, you know, that's a, a great coaching staff there to have. So. You mentioned Larkham, Gregan, another one that used to run around with down in Canberra. He's come out uh, in the last couple of days along with Eddie Jones, your, your coach at Suntory, and said, June, Wallabies, they reckon you're a walk-up start. What would you have to say to that? Oh, look, I, these are two people that I respect, uh, you know, hugely. You know, George Gregan's done it all, and, then, and Eddie Jones is a, a mentor of mine. So, uh, you know, their, their opinion I do take, um, take on board. And, look, I'd, if I was considered for the, the, the Wallabies, um, got, I, I'd definitely think about it, because uh, it is such a huge occasion. But first and foremost, I have to, you know, earn that spot and, and earn, earn the spot within the Brumbies. Yeah, George Smith there with Sean Maloney. He's keen if he's asked to play for the Wallabies. Will he play for the Wallabies in June? Oh, I think he'll be in the mix, no doubt. But when you've got Hooper, Pocock and Gill, uh, really talented sevens. If you'd said that, if you'd asked that question two or three years ago, you'd say yes, definitely. But you've got so much stock there in the sevens. But um, as George said, he's got to play for the Brumbies first. Okay. I mean, Peter Kimlin's on the side at the moment, and you'd expect that probably George would maybe start off the bench the first couple of games and earn that spot. Exactly. And it's a balancing act for Jake White and the coaching staff in Canberra. You know, how do you introduce George into the team? Obviously, coming off the bench, I think, is certainly his best position. And I think number eight open side is where he probably is best served. But within a couple of games, you expect to see George Smith playing some significant minutes for the Brumbies. I'll tell you what, there's, there's not too many players who have um, played in two line series, winning line series. So it'd be a special occasion if he gets that opportunity.